Meena, right? Is Meena, you know, right? She got trained, she got placed with the company, and then she moved into Icon. She was working almost around two, three years uh, with, uh, with Icon. She was working with Icon. Right now, she's in Dubai. You know that, right? Yeah, ma'am. You know Meena. You know Meena. Yeah. She got trained with our institute. And the thing is, like, this is how they sound. Because the first question is like, when tiles for a clinical record, anybody? You can see the picture. You know no, her? No, she's almost around three, four years back. Yeah, she's also from SRM. Akila. Her name is Akila. B Tech Biomed. Your what is your qualification? B Tech Genetics. Genetics. Okay. She's from uh, B Tech uh, Biomedical Engineering from SRM. JPR, we have anybody in JPR? JPR, we are not having Satya Bama, no for me, right? See, he is Pramod. And you can see the profile. B Tech in Biotechnology 2012 from JPR. And Masters in Drug Delivery from UK 2014. Okay, so why do you think from B Tech he goes to a Masters in Drug Delivery to UK and come back to India and take a course? Can you understand what is the market after you finish B Tech Biotechnology? Where do you go? This is what is. I mean, we have a lot of people from who has done SRF, senior research for Arthur B. I have from Satya Bama also. Yeah, the next guy is there. He is from Satya Bama. Srinivas Srikar is 2009 batch, Satya Bama. Okay, and he finished in uh, b Tech Biotechnology in 2009. And his, uh, no, the picture is the same one from here. He was doing the presentation, the picture shows. Okay, MS Canada 2014. And he comes back to India and he finds there is a job only for 10 to 12,000. Because obviously you uh, US and he didn't have the visa after that. He was able to work till, uh, you know, as a person, as a SR, JRF, I think. He was working as a research fellow there. And after three years of research fellow, after almost spending around 15, 16 lakhs, he came back to India to find out it was hardly 10 to 12,000. And in Chennai, they felt it is overqualification. You're already MS. And all these people actually represent a part of you, which is like B.Tech by technology. After that, what we do, we think that you know, going in for a MS degree or a JRF, SRF. You can't go for JRF, M.Tech you have to do. After M.Tech by technology, you go into this. And after all this, why do they come in search of a clinical research industry? It's the kind of job opportunities. The demand is very high. You're able to go ahead very fast. It's from uh, B Farm. We have a lot of pharmacy students. There's no question at all. Pharmacy and B Tech is huge. Adi Bhagavan College. I'm just keeping up to your inner profession. We have some Vinaya Commission students also. Okay, a lot of. Uh, so you are going to learn in depth about what clinical research, CDM, harmful vigilance is all about. What are the kind of companies, what are the designation, what are the salary package, everything is going to come in. Okay. So we will just uh, begin up with one of our students starting up with a small presentation. So you will have various presentation who will be giving you clips about different topics in the same thing. Udesh, take over. 